I don't know how much you've been able to look across social media in the past, like, 24 hours, but the impact the pair of you have made has spread across the globe. You're looking at people in Great Britain giving you the comparisons of Torval and Dean and everything no. like that as well. How does it feel that... I mean, you've talked a lot about representing Canada, but it's the impact you're also making to so many people across the globe. I was seeing people saying, for these next three, four minutes, I'm Canadian. I'm nothing else in the world but being Canadian because oh, wow. they wanted oh, to support yeah. you guys. How does that sort of reflect you now? That's incredibly touching no and kidding. wonderfully heartwarming. We're so grateful for that support. And it's always a great thing for our sport when people can connect, um, connect to a performance, connect to a story. Um, you know, there are so many great storylines that come out of an Olympic Games, and, and that's what we love about it as fans. Um, you know, we'll be tuning in and cheering on all of the other our teammates and, and watching the rest of the events, and, and we'll be those people then, <laughs> you know, just enraptured by, by what the athletes are doing. But it means a lot to us. You know, we, we've been so invested in our material this year. We love, we love the characters we get to play on the ice. We love our programs. We love our product. And... Um, hopefully the emotions we're portraying are, are universal and they resonate with people. Um, you know, we only have three and four minutes to, to make people feel something and to bring them into our world for a few moments and, and potentially escape. And, and it's been thrilling to do so on the world's biggest stage and we feel grateful for that opportunity. And, and thank you to everyone for, for tuning in and cheering us on. Um, with, with the Torval and Dean thing, I mean... As Tessa said, it's, we're just honored to be in the same sentence as them, but we're able to have the opportunities that, that we have because of, of teams like that. I mean, I, I think their story is so different than ours, but um, the reason why we maybe don't put ourselves in that same sentence as them is because they've given our sport so much credibility. And what their Olympic movement moment has done for ice dance is, uh, has given it such credibility. So we have nothing but respect. and. Uh, for them and and for all the champions that have come before us, I mean we're pretty proud of uh, to be ice dancers and you know it, to be able to have that mixture of athleticism and art and um, you know the sport has to evolve. You know, hopefully there will be some some teams that come up that uh, take a little bit of what we've done, like like we have of watching tapes of Torval and Dean and uh, Mary France and Patrice and, and great teams that come before us, and um, they can continue on. It's uh, we need to get. Faster, stronger, better. We can't wait to see what happens.